That's a good one, actually. Um, actually, that you know how that went. Margaret loves telling that story, so I'm just gonna let actually, her do that. I love telling that story. Yeah, for sure. That's so exciting. Well, Andrew and I were about to celebrate our first anniversary together. Yeah, first one. Too. And I knew he'd be dying to ask me to marry him. <laughs> and I knew he was scared like a tiny little bird. So I started leaving hints here and there because I knew he wouldn't have the guts to ask. Girl, that's not how it went. No? No, no, no. Well, actually, you got the part about the hints, right? You know, I, I felt like it was just like candy. I was grabbing them hints like they're mine, you know? Yeah, like flash. Yeah, 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 like that. But yeah. I was just afraid that you would find this little box I left for you. You remember that? Oh, that the coupage box. Uh, it was so pretty, so little. Like, oh, so yeah. cute for him to make it. He, was, he pasted lots of selfies of himself oh, all yeah, over yeah. the box. I mean, he loves taking selfies. Oh, and when selfies. I opened it, like, this red confetti mm. fl flew all over the place. And when I looked down and saw that most beautiful... Real big, fat, nothing. Not a zip, no ring. But besides all that crap, because I remember putting the confetti so it could go on your face. That was, that was the best part. Yeah, but like besides a all bomb. that, yeah, yeah, like that. Besides yeah, all that, wonderful. <laughs> I remember leaving a, a little note. You remember the note? Yeah, of course. And so mysterious. Yeah, yeah. It had the, the time, the place, and what hotel to go to. So I remember just leaving that. You remember that? Yeah. I thought he was seeing someone else. Mm. It was a terrible time for me. I mean, you know, it's your son. He's kind of a player sometimes. Mm. I mean, look at him. He's so cute and handsome stuff. Well, uh, but I went to a hotel anyway. Yeah. And when I went, I found it on the door. Mm. But it was already unlocked, so I swung it open. And there he was. Standing. Your son, Standing. kneeling. So cute. <laughs> like a man. In a bed of rose petals. Oh. And he was choking, soft, soft sobs. <sighs> yeah. And when oh, yeah. he kind of caught his breath, he looked at me and said, Margaret. Will you marry me? And I said yes. That's it. Who's hungry? 